Hello and welcome to Cooking with Podal. Today we're going to cook a West Norwegian meal that I'm sure you'll love. Um, uh, welcome to my beautiful rented apartment. Today we're going to be cooking CPU and RAM pasta. I haven't checked what this is yet. So let's take a look at today's recipe. We've got an AMD FX CPU for some reason, like, don't know why. And we have some high quality DDR1 RAM that we'll be using that will really bring out the flavor in this meal. And I don't even know how I got it. My passport doesn't even work properly. So my debit card expires like next week, so I don't know how to get home. So let's go to the kitchen start. So what you want to do now is you want to wash the RAM. You want to get that silicon off the, the base PCB. If you bought it off eBay, it's probably arrived from some like industrial unit. We're just going to go take a look at washing. I just don't remember what ingredients to use. Wet, wet RAM. I'm just going to let it dry for a little bit, five minutes. Pat it gently with some toilet roll. Pat the round down, get rid of that silicon crap that's on there, maybe a bit of radium. Just gets rid of that disgusting taste that you normally get from cheap ram. There you go. And what's left would be the soldering smell, which is what you want. There you go. I'm just gonna grab a pot to put some water in, so let's do that. There you go. This is the main area we uh, cook our meal, you know. Let's go and get a plate. view from the house, pretty beautiful. Over here, we have the beautiful nuclear reactor fallout. It's just happened, it's a bit of radiation. The local power plant has just ignited and nuclear bomb has gone off. So, not a pretty sight, but... The pasta that we'll be using today is um, penne, which is a traditional Italian meal. It expands really nicely, it tastes great, and I think it'll be beautiful with that ram. And we have the beautiful Olive arrow butter. It's beautiful. What you want to do is Now what you want to do, once it's done, you want to add the CPU and the RAM to the pasta. That nice texture in there, nice flavour. I'm just going to add a bit of olive oil, a bit, a bit of flavour. You're pretty much done. There are, there are other ways to get your RAM tasting a lot better, which I'll show you now. So what you can do with the RAM is you can try adding a bit of cheese to it, you know, spread it all over the transistors and silicon to really bring out that taste. Or we'll just open a simple tub of pasta sauce. Pasta sauce. Um, just buy from like Aldi or something, I don't, I don't know. We'll just lob it in the oven for like five minutes. Dip it in mayonnaise or something else. Then we're gonna add a fork. And we're done. Now what you wanna do What else can I put in there? Now once we're done, let's go and enjoy the sunset with our nice meal. We can read about the myth of capitalism. Well, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, hope you enjoyed making the meal yourself. I'm going to read this book and enjoy the sunset.